What seemed like a distant dream is now just days away from becoming a reality. That's right, college game day in Bozeman, Montana for one of college football's most historical rivalries. And not only is this a first for the Treasure State, but college game day has never come to a Big Sky campus. But that's, of course, until this Saturday. You know, we worked really hard, as everyone knows, last year to try to get it in Missoula. Thought we had a great shot, but it didn't happen. All that the people at ESPN kept telling us was just keep at it. Just keep the social media push going. Keep people talking about it. Keep doing creative things. And so when I got the text this morning from my friends there at 6.15 a.m., um, I, was, I was speechless. As was most of Montana, but as Bobcat Athletic Director Leon Costello shared, he and his staff didn't waste a single second getting to work. They did tell us that they would be here at 9 o'clock in the morning on Sunday if we were selected. So some of them flew in last night. They were there at 9 o'clock this morning. Uh, we had a campus tour in the snow as it was snowing for them to look at different sites on where they wanted to host the, the, the show on Saturday morning. Um, and then we talked all logistics. They really wanted to try and capture the uniqueness uh, of the state of Montana and Bozeman and our athletic department, and our university. And so I think you're going to see a lot of those things within the show. And while the venue remains a secret for the time being, as well as a celebrity guest picker, what we do know is there's a big push to tap in Pat McAfee's daring side. We want to play that up a little bit, maybe get him on a horse, maybe take him to uh, the rodeo practice facility, see if he'll get on, you know, something and ride it around. Uh, uh, it would be kind of fun just to show really the, the country and the world, the culture that we have here in the state of Montana. Obviously, rodeo is a huge part of that. And now that they're in the athletic department, it'd be great to showcase them as well. Montana State says they hope to have a breakdown by Wednesday with the map of the set, as well as logistics for parking entrances and a schedule leading up to kickoff. But in the meantime, here are two things the Big Sky Commissioner really wants fans to know. Number one, you have to get there early. The best places to stand and participate are going to fill up quick, so you have to get there early. You know, and then number two, you've got to come up with the most creative but clean signs that they can show on TV. You heard the man. College game day begins bright and early at 7 a.m. this upcoming Saturday. Kickoff for the 121st Brawl of the Wild will follow at noon, which will be returning to the MTN airwaves for the first time in 10 years. And like I said earlier, this is just the beginning of our Brawl of the Wild coverage, so make sure you stay with us as we lead up to kickoff.